What's up guys, Ryan right here. This is how you create designs for any print on demand product, including merch by Amazon using this app called Word Swag. So I think it's free for iOS and maybe cost $4 for Android if I remember correctly. Anyways, once you launch the app, tap this icon in the bottom right. It's like the two images. That's how you create images. Then tap transparent background because for our purposes, we need that transparency. Now you'll get this layout by default. You want to double tap into the text and type your text. Uh, if you don't know any, actually, you can just tap down the side and they'll generate it for you. So there you go. Say no to drugs, say yes to tacos. I like that. Let's go with that. Then I'm going to hit save and close and we will work with this. Also, I'm going to zoom out. I don't know why it zooms in so much now. It didn't used to do that. All right. So you're like, what is, what is all the hype about? What's going on here? Well, what's cool about this app is that for one, going across the bottom here, you see one, two, three, four, five, and then dice. You can rearrange the styles or the layout of this style. I don't know exactly how to describe it. I'm tapping the dice repeatedly right now and just watching it cycle through different approaches to using this style. So this style is called square number nine. But if I tap to the right of it, simply good. This is a different style. And this one needs to be zoomed in a bit. So you can see now how I'm cycling through and it's swapping kind of the rendering just a little bit. And you can keep doing this until you see uh, layouts that you like. So this one's called fresh. Say no to drugs, say yes to tacos. And you can keep cycling through. It's kind of weird though how they, the app did not used to be this way where I'd keep having to pinch to zoom and then not. So that's a little odd. But if you don't feel like doing design, you can just pop into this app and uh, it can generate this stuff for you. Long shot. That one looks kind of cool. Flower rendering called Full Bloom. Key West. This one looks alright. Special Dark. Puts it in like a circle. Not too many different uh, styles to cycle through there. New caption. Wet paint. I like this one. I've, I've sold some shirts using this uh, this layout. This one right here with like the paint spots too. Not bad looking. So I'm going to save this one. And we'll pull it into uh, Photoshop and resize it. So I'm going to hit share. And I'm going to push this to my Google Drive. And I'll retrieve it from there later. Let's try to find at least one more. Maybe around the world. This one looks alright. Punch out, shout out, say no to drugs, say yes to tacos. This one's pretty cool. Look at that. So this is more like the ones that sell well on t-shirts. Some of these, maybe not all of them. Like this one probably would sell. So I'll upload that to Drive. And let's see, any other good ones? I mean, there's so much that you can mess around with. Stack Attack, this one I've sold for sure, a bunch of, a bunch of designs. But there's nothing really to this. It's just like going into Photoshop and typing some text and like changing the angle that it renders at. The Jack one, this is a good one too. Again, there's no skill involved here. They generated the saying for us and they're generating the layout for us. So let's see, that, that could go on a shirt too. sketchy times uh, any others this one's good I like the one with the the line in between there we go like this all right so what is that three or four different ones that we can play around with so I hit save to drive this is just how I do it I save to my Google Drive and then I just retrieve it from there. So I'm gonna exit out of the phone now and I'm gonna pull these up on my desktop. All right guys, and then from here, all you have to do is download your files to your desktop, uh, however you go about doing that. And I wanted to show you in the Windows uh, image viewer, but of course they still haven't figured out how to show um, white text over a black background. So this is an example that I prepped in a separate video. It just says work hard, play hard. And you can see like the dimensions that Word Swag renders it at is 2048 by 2048. So I just pulled into Photoshop and 
fit it how I like it. So if we're using this for Amazon merch specifically, we don't get to like play around with how it's going to be laid out on the product outside of right now where you actually like save your PNG. So I'd recommend doing this for Amazon merch, especially if you're uploading to like Printful, you'd be able to do it in the, uh, in the like product creation wizard. So for now, we'll just leave it like this. So I'm going to turn off the background and save this as merch optimized on the desktop. So we'll just call it work hard, play hard. Um, yeah, that works. All right, and then I'll kill that layer, bring the black background in again, say no to drugs, say yes to tacos, position this about like there. See, this looks good. The app just cranked that out for us in two seconds. Turn off the background. And yeah, say no to drugs, say yes to. So guys, I made a video about this the other day, but like when you do your file naming conventions, you want to do something similar to what you see me doing with relevant keywords and uh, dashes instead of spaces is always good practice. Say no to drugs, say yes to, so you could blow it up a little bit too, make it bigger, centered, there we go, brilliant. And you know what I might actually do guys is uh, that black text so that we just let it see through to the color of the shirt in the back. I'm going to merge these layers and then what you can do is you can just like select color range and click the black and then just cut it like that so now if we were to like make a i don't know like a pink or purple background it'll show through like that instead of it being like hard coded as black so a little trick there i think it looks better this way and more consistent with the design uh, so yeah save this Say no to drugs, say yes to tacos two, number two. And then just to show you guys the other ones, we don't have to save them. We don't have to go through the extra step of saving them, but I'll just pop them up here and show you. So I'd probably make this a little bit bigger. I think bigger designs sell well. That looks about right. Pretty good. And the last one is right here. Wait, did I skip one? This, this, this. Nope, that's all four. All right, yeah, so we just cranked out. I didn't save it, but yeah, four easy merch by Amazon designs. As you can see here, work hard, play hard came out of the Word Swag app. I did that on a separate video. Say no to drugs using the paint splatter. I think that looks really good as well. And I forget what this one was called, but I mean, you guys could... Hopefully you're in agreement that like if people were looking for a say no to drugs, say yes to tacos shirt, like this looks like a professionally designed, nice symmetric layout. And it's not like we couldn't accomplish this ourselves using graphic design software. But I mean, how easy was it to use that app? And I, I mean, I think it's free iOS and uh, four dollars in Android. Let me see. Word swag app uh, Android. Uh, well, I have it installed, so bad example, but iOS, see where it's free. Yeah. So free iOS and four bucks Android, but well worth the $4. I've been using it, uh, for years and I don't use it like as a primary go-to, but I use it on the side for whenever I don't feel like if, if it's like a text-based design and I think, you know, I'm pretty familiar with the styles in the word swag app. And if I think I can crank one out there, uh, quickly and easily, then I just use that, you know, it's simple enough. So anyways, guys, hope you liked this video. If you got anything out of it, please hit that like button. Please consider subscribing. If you have any questions, comments, feedback, hit me up below, and I'll see you at the next one.